Mike Pence took the stage. He was the keynote speaker tonight. It was his big introduction to, to a national audience. I accept your nomination to run and serve as vice president. Pence poked fun at himself a little bit, said, you know, I realize most people don't know who I am. Mike Pence did a pretty good job at introducing himself to the nation. He described himself as a Christian, a conservative, and a Republican um, in that order. Mike Pence um, is, is really a, a, a good balance, I think, for Donald Trump in a lot of ways. He can deliver an, uh, an aggressive message, but he doesn't do it in the same um, you know, brash tone, perhaps, that Donald Trump did. One of his best lines tonight was talking about um, how police officers are, are out on the front lines. Um, you know, he's really standing up for that, that Blue Lives Matter idea that, that's it's been a mantra here. <laughs> Ted Cruz made his, his big appearance. And there was a lot of drama leading into that appearance. You know, he, he was Donald Trump, Donald Trump's chief rival um, in, in the final days of the primary contest. When Ted Cruz finished his speech and did not explicitly endorse Donald Trump, things got wild. <laughs> Boos rained down from all parts of this convention hall. It, it got so bad that I was told that Donald Trump's staff actually had to go out and ask folks to be more polite. The boos were raining down until Donald Trump himself walked into the, the convention hall, kind of calmed things down a bit. But there's no question coming out of day three of the convention what the main story is, and, and it was Ted Cruz. I think today was by far the, the most energetic day that we've seen. Day four, um, the Trump campaign hopes will top that. It's not only Donald Trump, but also Ivanka Trump who is uh, you know, probably his, his most popular child. The Trump speech itself, um, you know, we've been told that, that, he, that it, essentially it's gonna be Trump being Trump, that there will be a script. You know, his, his team's been working, working hard on this speech, but as is the case usually with Trump, you don't really know if he'll stick to that script. The campaign has, has a plan going in. It's anybody's guess as to whether or not Donald Trump will stick to it. Um, either way, like I said, it, it, will, it will be the most watched political speech in convention history.